If you have a copyright claim on one of your YouTube videos, stick around because this is a complete guide on how to fix it. Let's do this. VidIQ. VidIQ. VidIQ.com. The first thing you need to do is click on your profile image in the top right hand corner of the screen on most YouTube pages and go to the YouTube studio. From the dashboard page, click on the video section down the left hand side to list all of your most recent videos. You will see a filter button which if clicked gives you the option to show you only those videos with copyright claims against them. Now on this video list you will see a restrictions column and if you mouse over the copyright claim you can click on see details to display the copyright claim pop-up screen for the affected video. The top section will display the impact the copyright claim is having on your channel, the video's global visibility and monetization of the content. Below that you can view the video itself, see the specific copyright claim as well as what actions you can take. The replace and mute song options are long existing YouTube tools that will do exactly as described. However, this new trim out segment gives you a little more control. This new feature will highlight the segment of the video directly relating to the copyright claim, offering the creator the opportunity to remove it and release a claim against that segment of the video. Do bear in mind that any features such as info cards, ad breaks, and end screens contained within the trim section will be removed from the video. If you're happy, click continue to resolve the issue. Have you ever encountered any copyright issues on your own YouTube channel, intentional or not? Do let us know in the comments below and whether or not you think this tool will help you in the future. Hello, I'm Rob and welcome to vidIQ, the YouTube tool and channel that aims to educate you on your YouTube journey. Make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss any of our content and click on the notification bell so that you're notified first when we release new content. Of course, creators can run into all sorts of copyright issues if they don't understand the licensing laws behind them. And how often have you seen video creators try to hide behind the fair use defense, which often isn't fully understood by the creator themselves. To be honest, if you're actively trying to put disclaimers into your video and the video descriptions, the chances are you probably don't fully understand fair use. There are also times when copyright claims can happen by mistake. You just happen to be vlogging outside and there is some copyright music playing in the background, then really, unfortunately, there's nothing you can do about it. It's just unfortunate circumstances. In more extreme cases, and with those who clearly flaunt the copyright rules, if you get copyright strike, then you could be in serious trouble. Three of them and your channel is terminated. No ifs or buts. So as a word to the very wise out there, learn up on copyright. There's lots of material on YouTube and I'm going to leave some links in the video description. If you do decide to trim the video, YouTube will need time to process this as well as re-evaluating your video for monetization. If you need to check your channel for more serious copyright strikes, from the YouTube studio, go to settings then channel, followed by the advanced tab at the top and at the bottom of this screen you will see a link to status and features. It's a pretty old screen at this point and is likely to change soon but currently it tells you all of the YouTube features you have access to as well as any community and copyright strikes on your channel. So as you can see although we have a couple of copyright claims that may affect monetization on individual videos we don't have any of the more serious copyright strikes against the channel. Now perhaps you're on the flip side of this copyright equation and someone is using your copyrighted YouTube content. Well, if you are part of the YouTube Partner Program, you may have access to the copyright tool which shows you if video creators are using your content without your permission. We have a full video tutorial on this tool, so make sure to check it out if you want to know more. And did you notice these extra features down the left hand side? Well, these are just some of the awesome channel growth tools you will get access to if you download vidIQ. It will help you research YouTube, analyze any video on the platform, order your own YouTube channel and take actionable steps. It is free to download. There is a link in the video description. For more YouTube beginners guys just like this, check out the playlist over here. And to learn more about vidIQ and how it can help grow your channel, we've got a beginner's guide down there. Thank you very much for watching. And of course, enjoy the rest of your video making day.